At the Alameda County Fair in California, the crew from Sky Elements Drone Shows is preparing to light the sky, placing 100 drones on their marks. When night falls, they take flight. Do you think this is the way of the future? Oh, absolutely. I think drone shows are going to become more and more common. This 4th of July holiday, some cities are trading the boom of fireworks for the buzz of drones. Drone shows don't have the noise element that fireworks do, they don't have the trash element, and, and they don't have the fire danger either. According to the National Fire Protection Association, fireworks were responsible for igniting more than 19,000 blazes across the United States in 2018. In Klein Village, Nevada, near Lake Tahoe, didn't want to chance it and made the switch to drones. We looked at the safety issues uh, around uh, fireworks. You know, I, I kind of look at the concept of lighting, lighting, you know, throwing lit objects up into the sky. And is that the best thing to do at the height of the fire season? Preston Ward is the chief pilot for Sky Elements and also has pyrotechnic experience. He says each show lasts about 12 minutes and the drones are programmed with a flight path based off a custom animated storyboard. The number of drones can range from 100 to 1,000. Generally, our shows run between 350 and $450 a drone. So that's kind of the range and, you know, it just scales up from there. So about a 100 drone show runs about $35,000. For some, it's just the right price for wowing crowds with a safer alternative to a holiday tradition. Donya Backus, CBS News, Pleasanton, California.